My name is James Cowling, I'm CTO of Oxford Computer Group, and one of the immediate focuses right now is on the privileged access technology that Microsoft has recently released. We've been talking about this for some time, but with the release of our new training course on the subject and with the uh, activity around workshops and increasing customer interest, uh, it's been very interesting at this conference uh, to understand exactly what customers want to do with it. So talking to customers, it is clear that first of all, there's a very deep-seated fear of breach and fear of loss of, of credentials around privileged access. And the question is, you know, what do I do? How do I get from here to there? How do I implement this new technology? So the technical implementation is pretty easy to understand and reasonably easy to carry through. But I think what has been an eye-opener for many customers that we've been speaking to at this conference and elsewhere is that the implications for the organization of the implementation go beyond the technical and into the process and the organization of your security department and your ability to respond to threats and your ability to respond to uh, requests for privileged access and so on over time. And this is not just a sort of side activity that you can just quickly bolt on to your regular admin activity. It has deep implement impl implications for your security environment if you're going to do it properly. So the comments I've been getting have been, oh, this is more deep-seated, more complicated, if you like, for the organization than I had originally thought. And so I think we're bringing a good deal of value to the customers here. First of all, elucidating the technical situation they need to implement, and also offering to them through our training and then through our ongoing support on site with them as they go through the projects, uh, helping them actually get from here to there, getting to the state where they can reasonably trust their privileged environments and have a strong sense of security that they're not being threatened immediately by the theft of privileged credentials.